Now, let's find the numerators. Meron kasi nag-PM sa akin na, ma'am, paano to yung hanapin daw yung uh, numerators? Like, ganito ba? Ganito mismo yung tanong. So, parang test paper yata yun, basta. Anyway, so, I'm going to give you four examples here how to find the numerators. Let's do number one. Isulat lang natin para mas klaro sa inyo. N over 24 equals 1 half. All you have to do is just ratio and proportion. Do this cross multiplication. Okay? So this is 24 equals 2N. Since si 2 pang multiply sa N, pang divide siya sa 24. Then, n is equal to 24 divided by 2, and that is 12. Ganun din ang gagawin mo sa the rest. So, this is n is equal to, n is equal to 12. Wait. n is equal to 12. Now, if you don't want to do that, yung bali shortcut natin, pero pareho lang din naman, Pero kung gusto mo parang shortcut style, 24, i-divide mo siya. 24 divided by 2, that is 12. I-multiply mo dito sa numerator. Multiply. This is division, multiplication. 22 divided by 2, 12 times 1, and that is 12. Next. Kung anong ginawa natin, yan din ang gagawin natin sa number 2, okay? So, this is 20 and 3 fourth. 20 divided by 4 and that is 5 times 3 and that is 15. So, n is equals to 15. Ulitin lang natin yung isang style na ginawa natin. So, equals 3 fourth. Cross multiplication. So this is 30 times 3, that is 60. Then 4n. Since si 4 pang multiply sa n, pang divide siya sa 60. So 60 divided by 4 equals n. 60 divided by 4, and that is 15. Next, dito tayo sa number 3. Erase muna natin ito. Erase at ito siya kasi i-fill in lang natin itong number 3. So this is 1, 2, 5 and 1, 5th. 1, 2, 5 divided by 5 and that is 25. 25 times 1 and that is 25. So n is equals to 25. Another way. Yung n over 1, 2, 5 equals 1 fifth. Cross multiplication. So this is 1, 2, 5. Pwede rin ganito. Pareho lang yan. This is 5n equals 1, 2, 5. Para ma-isolate si n dito, since si 5 pang multiply sa n, so pang divide na siya sa 1, 2, 5. N is equals to 1 to 5 divided by 5, and that is 25. Next, dito tayo sa number 4. Erase ulit natin ito. At ito rin. So, sa number 4, this is over 77. 3 over 11. 77 divided by 11, and that is 7. 7 times 3 and that is 21 so n is equals to 21 or we will do the cross multiplication okay 3 over 11 cross multiplication so this is 11 n equals 77 times 3 and that is uh, 231. Since si 11 pang multiply sa n, pang divide ngayon siya sa 231. So, n is equals to 231 divided by 11, and that is 21. 
please comment down below kung na-perfect mo siya. Thank you for watching.